Today I am going on a hunt with my friend Ricardo. I actually met Ricardo in the Hot Wheels aisle in July or August, I believe, of 2023. So he messaged me today and asked me if I wanted to go on a hunt. I said absolutely because I just happen to have the day off. So we're going to go do that right now. But before we go, I just want to show you some progress on some updates because I know a couple of you asked me to show, like Nebu, I read your comment, dude. I'll do my best to show you some of these customs, guys, as I make them. So as you saw in a previous video, I had picked up that Lamborghini right there at a car show and I had this Porsche just laying around. I actually got this one from the flea market in the used car bin, which I'm going to return to very soon. Just in case you guys are wondering, if you've never seen my custom video, I use this clean strip premium stripper. You just spray it on the cars and it strips the paint. It's pretty easy. This nozzle is actually broken though, so the compression and the scan is totally gone. So I gotta go buy a new one, but I've been able to shake it out a little bit and get it to drip on the cars. And I'm assuming by the time I get back home, the paint should be peeling off these cars and then we can brush it off with a toothbrush. Also, if you did see that video the other day as well, I thought I didn't buy it. It looks like I did. So I thought it was metallic purple, it's not, but we have the pearlescent clear coat. So we're gonna use that. And that's the color we're gonna paint the Lamborghini. I haven't really decided on the Porsche yet. I definitely don't wanna paint them the same color as they came, because I feel like that just kind of defeats the purpose. So it's some point hopefully i'll be good enough to be able to polish the car's metal to get him looking like that but until then we're just going to stick to normal stuff and um, i'm trying my best to get better at adding the details in guys but not always such a good job but that's always where i mess up the car i actually snapped a chassis earlier too which was really annoying because the car was coming out perfect anyways let's get this video started i'm gonna head over to ricardo's right now i think i'm hopping in with him and we're gonna go on the hunt for some cool hot wheels all right guys i'm here at ricardo's house he's got an insane setup with so many hot wheels here a lot of these familiar faces we've seen so many of these that is sick how much money you think is here in this wall i got a little bit over a thousand dollars look at that here for 2022 porsche 935 the whole Porsche set up here. We all know how hard this one was to find. That is so cool. Man, I bet you could spend hours just looking at all this. Ooh, that's sweet. Pagani Waira. Some team transports down here. This is one of my favorite castings right here. And that one. I don't know what it is about the EB110. I just love it. Godzilla. I think that's how I met him right there. That little Aventador. What is it? The... Yeah, the Revenant. That's it. That's the car you gave me. That's gated. the car. So I met him at Walmart and I had one in my hand and he looked at it. He's like, oh, that's really nice. And I was like, yeah, that's cool. And I walked away and I was just like, you know what? I'm going to go give it to him. I went back. He's like, no, no, no. I'll find it. And I'm like, you won't because I, I took him out of the pin. So that's how I met him. We exchanged information and the rest is history. But yeah, this is his wall. Definitely awesome. This inspires me because I mean, I have this pegboard. I just don't have long pegs. I tried to get some from work and they wouldn't let me take them home. So we are oh doing God. a little bit of a, he's giving me some cars here. He told me a long time ago he was going to give me this. So these are some of his duplicates, I guess. I'm going to have to return the favor <laughs> for him for sure. I've been planning on actually going through my collection and pulling out duplicates because the Lord knows I have them. You want some to, uh, I know that you're some customizing. Customs, yeah. Grab whichever you like. Dude, uh, I'll make you one too. For uh, sure. I'll I make don't, you a couple. What, I, what's I your favorite one in here? And I'll make Well, you said you make your own too? Well, I started working on some of them. Mm -hmm. And what happens is baseball season is upon us. Yeah. And I don't know if I told you, you know, I coach high school baseball. Right, right. So I haven't had a chance to even touch them. This is a Carrera GT, isn't it? It's, it yeah, that's is. A GT. I do not have one. Oh, that's going to be a nice one. Yeah. Heck yeah. So I'm going to make some customs out of these guys. I mean, why not? I'll make one for him too. Ooh. Ooh. This is the RSR, isn't it? That is great right there. Holy crap. But you can go through anything that yeah, you I'll like. Yeah, I'll take like two or three. And you can pick and choose. It don't, it don't matter to me. I most likely never on this lifetime could do what I have. Right. Oh, this is my favorite. It's my favorite because it's just so satisfying when you're finished with them to just bring them back and you just kind of look at them. Maybe I'll get this one and make it for TJ or something. Dude. Isn't it cool how Hot Wheels can bring people together, man? Ooh. Ooh, I think I have one of those actually. All ready to be customized. NSX. The Cadillac, maybe? Yeah, we'll do the Cadillac. Cool. It's funny, because today I was just thinking, I gotta go get more Lucy's, so. All right, so you take, like, what, two or three of these? All right. Just show me what you got. Absolutely. Make sure that I don't give you something that I don't have anymore. Yeah, no, don't even worry about it. All right, so, man, there's a lot of cool stuff here. Bone Shaker, Chevy C10. Guys, this is gonna turn into two videos, I think, so. If you're liking what you're seeing, then I'm guessing the next few videos are gonna be the same. I don't have the yellow one. Yellow one? Grab it. All right, grabbing it. 
So I'm gonna go through my box, guys, because it's it's I have two over large size moving boxes overflowing. I need to start a third, so I'm gonna go through them and pull out a bunch of cars and do the same in return for Ricardo. Portion nine one four, same casting as a hard to find chase. Uh, McLaren Solis. So he's actually the one that tipped me off on the dumping at the new Walmart that I went and got so many of those Zamax. Oh, there's so many in here. I think that's good for this box. Now, the GT, the GT, uh, mini GTs are in one of them box. I think I got two that I repeated. I put them in there. Absolutely. All right, right. we're going to do a custom in this because I have finally have two. I only ever had one of these, and then I got another one and whatnot. I'm so happy. So I was just thinking this morning I need some Lambos to customize. I want to make one for Lisa. Uh, like anything, anything you need from the box is just seriously. <laughs> most <laughs> likely I got the repeated off. Um, well, just a few. There's might be five or six cars in there that I don't have to repeat it. I hate take. This is like TJ. He did this to me once. I'm like, dude, I don't, I don't want to take all your cars. He's like, no, take them. As you can tell, I don't have room for them. Yeah, I. I go in the attic. <laughs> this is exactly what it's all about guys. You want to trade your cars because honestly sometimes they just get out of control and you have too many of them Ooh, I'm seeing mini GTs oh, man. Bentley Man, you just bought this was this not just on the shelf? <laughs> Isn't this new or you got more than one? I don't know. I don't know. I might have another one I, I buy them and uh... And then I do what everybody does. I might have this, but I'm gonna yeah, get it. Yeah, I'm gonna get it again anyways. Yep, exactly. God, there's so much stuff in here. I spend all day looking at this. Ooh, that's cool. This is the Amac Nissan R390. I think I only have this in blue and white. Take like that. I think that's really all I see. I don't want to take all his cars. He keeps telling me to take them, but I don't want to take all his cars. <laughs> right, we'll pick one more. One more. One more. Boom. Because I gave my last one away. Heck yeah. All right, so that's I what I got like 12 of those. You really got that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. It, well, it's like, you know, we all get it. You, you see one, and it, it's funny because in that video, Lisa was like, I get it, Mike. I'm like, what? She's like, I have this car, but I have the urge to buy another one. I'm like, yeah. Yeah. That's exactly, exactly how it is. So, all right, these are the ones we're going to take, guys. So thank you so much to Ricardo for that. We're going to go on a hunt now. Quickly before we go, guys, because I know the comments are going to say, Mike, 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 why didn't you show us the cars? We're going to go through these cars very quickly and see what he's got here because there's so many, it's like you're at the store. So Porsche 911 GT3, the Z4 behind it. I bet you our local Walmart still has a bunch of these on the pegs. Nobody wanted to buy them from there. Ooh, the Panamera Turbo S. That's a cool one. Wait, when did they have card colors like this? What year was that? Tesla Model 3, the Jaguar XE. When when did the cards look like this? Was I not collecting at this period? Oh, this is a set. I see. Okay, what set is this? I don't know. I don't know. That's cool though. Audi R8 Spider in there. Ooh, that's a nice one. Silver. Tesla Roadster. Land Cruiser. There's the treasure hunt. Get a bunch of those. Have you seen the Honda set? There's a Honda set. Yes, it looks like this, right? Uh, it's similar, it's just like that other one with the Cadillac that you just looked at. Yeah, yeah. I wanna say that I found that one in Mobile, Alabama. Really? Yeah, a while back, about a year and a half, two years ago. I just saw it for the first time at a car show in Wesley Chapel. Custom hunt, I've never seen that color, that's cool. Man, this is so cool. Pull them out, Mike. Yeah, but that's just a lot of work. <laughs> They're gonna fall. That's probably my favorite one here. I just love the Paganis. And it's only because I've seen them in person and they're just like unbelievable. That's cool. Charger 500 right there. That color is awesome. Is that a TJ special? This is a TJ special? There's that Supra. It was so hard for everybody to find. The Senna. I just bought this on Whatnot. I was happy to get that. I have all the other colors except that one. Looks like a Batmobile set up there. Very, very cool. All right, guys, there's your quick little preview. If you want some type of in-depth thing, leave a comment. Let's see your cars, Ricardo, down below, and we'll see what we can do. We're going to go hit the stores now. Hope you enjoyed this little segment. There we go. Got one of those. One of my favorite.